Hi, my name is Madison S. with MyPracticeTestPrep.com. This is the second video in the free three-part video training series, Secrets to Passing the Club, the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass a biology club exam, guaranteed. Now, for those of you just joining us, in the last video, we covered what is the club and why you should take it. In this video, we're going to cover what's on the biology club exam and where to find the best free study guides. And then in the last video, we're going to cover Secrets to Passing the Biology Club and where to find the best free practice test. Now, feel free to skip around and watch all three as needed. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started on part two so you can discover the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the biology club exam in order to help you graduate faster with less student debt and jumpstart your career. Now, by the end of this free three-part video series, you'll learn what is the club exam and why you should take it, what to expect on the CLEP biology exam, past test takers exam specific feedback on the CLEP biology, where to find the best biology CLEP study guides, where to find the best biology CLEP practice test, what's a passing CLEP score, my other top secret tips and tricks, and finally my fast and easy three step secret to passing the biology CLEP exam guaranteed. Now we have a lot of information to cover in a short amount of time, so I have to talk really fast. But you can always rewatch this video or read the unabridged version on my website at bit.ly backslash clap biology. Now that is case sensitive, so please be sure to use all lowercase. Again, that was bit.ly backslash clap biology. So now that we got the formalities out the way, let's go ahead and get started so you can discover the fastest and easiest way to pass the biology clap exam guaranteed. Now before I show you the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the CLEP exam, to be completely transparent, I just want to tell you that the official CLEP study recommendation can always be found on their website at clep.collegeboard.com. So I just want to make it perfectly clear that what I'm about to tell you is the unofficial CLEP study guide that will show you how to shortcut all the fluff that I promise you you'll find on the College Board website and only focus on the key points needed to pass the CLEP exam. Because your goal is to test out of these required general and introductory level courses that your college makes you take as fast and easy as possible so you can get to the classes that are really important for your degree and your career while saving a whole bunch of time and money at the same time. And let me just say something to my critics right now. Because I respect the whole liberal arts educational model and think these classes are important to any quote-unquote well-rounded college graduate. But I just don't believe I should have to do 16 weeks worth of busy work and spend hundreds and thousands of dollars in college tuition to prove what I already know, or at least can study for in a few short weeks. And I believe that the independent study model offers just as much value to a person's education as a traditional brick and mortar classroom because number one, it teaches you how to be an independent learner, which is important to any college graduate. Number two, testing out of general and introductory level courses freeze your schedule to explore other courses of interest or more advanced courses in your degree. Three, it allows students to graduate faster, or on time for that matter, so you can jumpstart your career and begin your real world learning. And last, but certainly not least, my favorite, it allows students to save tens of thousands of dollars in college tuition and student loan debt. Heck, with the money saved, you can buy yourself a library if you're that motivated to learn. Now, if I'm preaching to the choir, I apologize. I had to waste your time with that rant. But there are a lot of days that criticize me for spreading a message that can really help a lot of college students for the reasons I just listed. So I just want to set the record straight. I believe education is important, but I do not, I do not believe in a one-size-fits-all educational model. And the CLEP exam can help students do just that. So with that being said, now let's get started. About the CLEP biology exam, most students say the biology CLEP test is a challenging exam to study for, but it is a very doable test. Although many past test takers admit, you'll feel like the more you study, the more you need to study, and even after you do all that studying, you still have to guess on a good portion of the test. But with the best biology CLEP study guides and the best biology CLEP practice test, with just a few short weeks of studying, you'll be able to test out of one year of science classes. Most students also credit the CLEP test as one of the best ways to pay for college tuition. And given that the cost of the CLEP test is less than the cost of your biology textbook for the course, and that you spend a fraction of the time studying than you would in a traditional 16-week biology classroom, it's a scientific fact, chuckle chuckle, that clepping out of college classes will save you both money in college tuition and time in the classroom. 
what topics are covered on the biology clep test. The biology clep exam covers a wide range of topics that are normally taught in a one-year college biology course. Important, since this is a science course, you'll also want to check with your college to determine if you still need to take a science lab section in addition to taking the clep. Usually with science courses, you have to take your lecture section and then your lab section. So you need to make sure you get that clarified before you take the exam because I would hate for you to get to graduation and find that out. I usually tell people that CLEP exams are designed to be self-study and even someone with limited or no prior knowledge or background can pass the exam in just a few short weeks and sometimes even days of studying, which I'll show you how to do that in the next section. But I do want to give you a little bit of a word of a caution because this is one CLEP that I'm going to have to make an exception for because it is not for the faint of heart and I definitely wouldn't advise it to anyone who didn't have any prior exposure to biology. Even if you only took a high school biology course many, many, many moons ago, if you can remember Mrs. Lee's uh, lessons on ATP and AD ADP, then at least you're on the right track. Now, if you haven't taken a biology class, I don't want to discourage you, but I just want to let you know what you're getting yourself into. Now, like I said, I don't want to scare you away, but just be warned that this exam will require more studying than any other club you're prepared for. because. Number one, you're testing out of two semesters of college classes. Other clubs usually test one semester. Number two, it's a science course which, which demands understanding and not just memorization. And three, it's biology. Look, biology is the study of life and living organisms. So that basically means the study of everything. And, and so the biology can go both wide and deep at the same time. A challenging ende endeavor even for the biology enthusiasts. But luckily, even the college work wouldn't be that brutal. So for the biology clap test, you will have 90 minutes to answer 115 multiple choice questions covering three biology subtopics, including molecular and cellular biology, organism biology, and population biology. Biology clap test secrets. The key to this exam is process of elimination. Again, there is a lot of information on the test and you are not, you are not expected to know it all. But if you can master the basics, then you can make an educated guess on the questions that go really deep. So this technique can work best if you can narrow down your choices to two, maybe even three possible answers. So that way you at least have a 50-50 chance of guessing correctly. And it's not uncommon to have to guess on half of the questions. So if you get to the exam and you're like, oh my God, I don't know half of these, that's okay. That's a normal experience and students still are able to pass this exam. Also, time management is crucial. Answering delays can prove costly on this exam. Work quickly and don't linger on any one question too long. Remember, each question is worth the same amount of points regardless of how hard or easy it is. So the name of the game is to work through the easy questions first and then mark the more difficult questions to return to at the end of the exam. Now with that being said, don't be surprised if you're pushed to the full 90 minutes time limit. So that's where I said guess on it first using the process of elimination and then mark it where you can come back to it. But I can guarantee you, you are going to be pushing your full 90 minute clock. Now I just want to kind of stop and pause right now because I know I probably scared you if you're like, oh my god, I don't want to take this. But trust me, many other past test takers will say, while this clap is a challenging exam, it is a very doable test. You just need to clear your head and focus on the exam. You know, do your best and forget the rest. You're not expected to know it all, know it all and you're probably going to have to guess on half the questions, but just take comfort that other students have this exact same experience as you and they still pass the exam. Testing out is easier than you think. Now, I know all this information may seem overwhelming at first. You may think that it's just easier to take the course at your college. Like, oh my God, I'm freaking out. I'm not going to be able to do this. But trust me, just use the Biology Club study guides and the Biology Club practice tests that I provided you for in this video series, and testing out of college classes will be easier than you think. Not to mention a great way to help you pay for college and earn your degree faster. How do I study for the CLEP Biology exam? To study for the CLEP exam, the College Board, the makers of the test, recommend you read several, that's several, 800 plus page college biology textbooks. Now that is a daunting task, even for the most studious overachiever. Even if you're a biology major, I'm sure that's not something you look forward to doing. So no wonder so many students believe the myth, it's a myth right now, that testing out of college classes is actually harder than just taking the damn class. Now in the next few slides, I'm going to give you a quick overview of what's on the biology club exam. Now I have to go really fast because I'm starting to run short on time, but you can see a more detailed explanation at bit.ly backslash club biology. Now that is case sensitive, so please be sure to use all lowercase.
Now remember there are three subtopics on the biology club exam and I outline some concepts that you're going to find under each of those subtopics. Now I know this looks really scary right now but remember the exam goes wide and not deep so that means you're not going to find any more than two to four questions on any particular concept. So I don't want you to think that you have to study for six months just to be at a pass exam. It's not as scary as it looks. I promise. So again, I had to go really quick, but you can see a more detailed explanation at bit.ly backslash clepbiology. Now, like I said, at first glance, that probably looks very scary. And we're going to disprove the myth that testing out of college is actually harder than taking the class. So let's go ahead and do I study for the biology clep test. Well, the truth is, CLEP tests were designed to be self-study for any student with the motivation and desire to pass the CLEP exam. So that's why I've put together the fastest and easiest way to help you prepare and pass the biology CLEP test. Instant Cert CLEP Study Guides. First, I always recommend you use the Instant Cert CLEP Study Guide because it is the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the biology CLEP test. Now, I personally use Instant Cert on all my CLEP and Dante's exam because it was like having your college professor's private classroom notes to help you study for the final exam. Now look folks, there's a lot of information out there that can help you prepare for the biology test and I'm going to give you some free resources shortly. But trust me, using a premium service like Instant Cert is the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the biology CLEP test guaranteed. There's no prior knowledge or background required, and you do not have to read hundreds of pages of fluff or spend hours researching the internet, because Instant Cert will give you a solid foundation on knowledge necessary to pass the CLEP exam. By spoon feeding you only the main points through their interactive learning format, they're able to keep your mind engaged and processing the information, so you're able to prepare and pass biology CLEP tests in a matter of days, not weeks. And thousands of successful past test takers will agree, Instant Cert was not only their secret weapon to passing the biology CLEP test, but also the only study guide they needed. Now, I don't have time to go into my full Instant Cert review, but you can watch my video at bit.ly backslash IC review. And as a special bonus, I secured you a $5 discount off your first month membership just for giving them a try. You just need to use Instant Cert discount code 3042. Free biology CLEP study guide. Now, after you reviewed a premium biology club study guide service like Instant Cert, free online preparation resources serve as a great supplement, bold underline, and I'll explain why I said that later, to your studies. Because Instant Cert will give you a solid foundational knowledge that you need to help you pass the exam, but those supplemental reading will help give you that extra confidence boost to improve your biology club score. Now, with that being said, I couldn't find a good, free, specific, and in-depth CLEP biology study guide. The stuff I found out there, it wasn't good, free, specific, or in-depth. None of that. It wasn't even worth me recommending, and it wasn't worth you wasting your time to even go and look at because it, it wouldn't help you anyway. So what I did was I took the syllabus of a typical biology undergrad course, which is what the exam is based on anyway, and then I took the syllabus of the CLEP biology exam, and then I spent hours and hours researching the internet for companion type websites to help you get some of those specific details of concepts that you might not grasp while you're taking your, your instant study guide. Give it all away for free. No catch or strings attached. Just go to my website, bit.ly backslash CLEP biology. And about halfway down the page, you'll see my free three-step sign-up form to download my secrets to passing the CLEP, Biology CLEP study guides, and practice tests. Again, that was bit.ly backslash CLEP Biology. Warning. Now, we'll give you a word of caution that this is a lot of information that is not as neatly organized as Instant Search, so you might get scared of at first. But please, please, please don't. I do not want you to think your way out of taking this exam because you believe the myth, like I said, this is a myth, especially if you're using Instant Cert, that testing out of college is actually harder than just taking the damn class. Because it's not. Because you do not need to know everything to pass. And that's why I do not, I do not recommend you use it without Instant Cert. Because it's information overload. And if it doesn't scare you away for, from taking the exam in the first place, it's definitely going to cause you to go into the exam with your head ready to explode. So use it as a supplement, bold underline, to Instant Cert only. Because remember, Instant Cert will help you skip the fluff and spoon feed you only the main points needed to pass the exam. These supplemental resources help kind of fill in that blank to give you more detail about some of the concepts that you want some more information of to help give you that extra confidence boost on the exam. Again, remember you can see, watch my Instant Cert review at bit.ly backslash IC review and that I secured you a special discount code 3014.2 where you can get $5 off your first month membership 
just for giving them a try. Well, this concludes the end of this video. And I just want to say good luck, fellow CLEP test takers. Now, again, remember this is a three-part series, so feel free to skip around or watch all three as needed. But by the end of this video series, I would have told you everything I know to help you prepare and pass the biology CLEP test. Now, the rest is up to you. So in the words of Larry the Cable Guy, go get her done. My name is Madison S. with MyPracticeTestPrep.com. What to do next? Again, if you haven't done so already, please be sure to watch all three free training videos, Secrets to Passing the Biology Club Exam. You can find any one of those videos at bit.ly backslash clepbiology1, 2, or 3. Remember that is case sensitive, so please be sure to use all lowercase. In part one, we're going to cover what is the CLEP exam. Part two, we're going to cover where to find the best biology CLEP study guides. And in part three, we're going to cover where to find the best biology CLEP practice test. So you're going to want to watch all three to get the most benefit to help you pass the biology CLEP exam guaranteed. Also, if you haven't done so, done so already, you're going to want to write down these links because these are the links mentioned throughout the video series and go visit them immediately. Step one, you're going to want to download my free Secrets to Passing the Biology CLEP exam at bit.ly backslash CLEP Biology. Step two, you're going to want to watch my Instant Cert CLEP study guide review at bit.ly backslash IC review. And remember, as a special bonus, I secured you a discount code where you can get $5 off your first month membership. You just want to use Instant Cert discount code 3042. And last, when you're ready to take some practice tests, you can find some at amzn.to backslash CLEP book or amzn.to backslash RIA. All these links are case sensitive, so please be sure to use lower case. Also, if you liked this video and you thought it was really helpful, please be sure to comment, rate, share, and subscribe to this page or video. Because that's what tells Google and YouTube that this is a really good video that can help other students learn how to pay for college by testing out of college. So by spreading the message to your family and friends, you help keep this content free for all. Bonus. More great ways to pay for college. Look folks, I am out of time on this video, so please be sure to pause the video, write down the links, and go visit them immediately, because I give you more great ways to help you find money to pay for college. Your traditional financial aid, scholarships, who can turn down free money, our good old friend student loan, and college coupons and deals that you won't be able to resist. Featured Sponsor I'd like to thank everyone for watching, and also like to thank the sponsors of this video that help keep this content free for you. The featured sponsor of this video is Prosper, America's leading social lending marketplace. I chose them after hearing an interesting news program on NPR a while back, where Prosper Marketplace was a way to connect people who wanted to invest money with people who wanted to borrow money. So basically, instead of going to a big corporate bank for your personal loan, you could post your loan request on Prosper and watch as dozens of members invest together to get you the money you need. Or you could be one of those investors yourself. And this is all done in a safe social lending marketplace. It's an innovative concept where people invest, borrow, and prosper. Please be sure to visit our sponsor at bit.ly backslash prosper lending. Again, that was bit.ly backslash prosper lending. And tell them Madison sent you. Well, that's it for me. Peace and love to all.